Hello there, we're going to be doing another Last Divinity Expert Challenge. This time it will be Extra Pain Train. And I actually had a pretty strong attempt at this where I got to the ninth ring and discovered one important fact. And that is that Ninja Training, in fact, applies to the mini boss waves in the ninth ring. Um, so on rings one, two, four, five, and seven. They work exactly like you expect. Uh, the bosses have some extra stealth, so you need to last through some extra rounds without being able to attack back if you're not able to deal with that. And I was able to deal with that, but um, in Last Divinity, um, they, they, if, if your you're a way to deal with that stealth involves having a lot of defense or chump blocks, then they just will walk to your pyre and kill you. So you need to, you have a, there are a ton of ways that you can deal with it, but, um, they, they basically involve a few things. You can do floor manipulation, so stuff like cave in or drip fall, uh, to keep them near the bottom and in, or entangle again to keep them near the bottom uh, you could kill them with spells um, you know just doing a ton of spell damage with stuff like crypt builders and spell weakness inferno stuff like that um, you could uh, remove their stealth resin removal is the main one I can think of I'm not sure if there's any others um, uh, cleansing water I guess you could hope to get lucky with that or you could uh, kill last divinity before they spawn oh, or yeah okay that's one way or you could make it so their damage is irrelevant so you daze them or sap them so the pirate kills them those are the ways i can think of to deal with it i wasn't prepared in my run because i didn't uh, think it would work like that so um i decided i wanted to go with melting remnant because they have several tools that could work uh one of which is resin removal, which just removes their stealth so you can deal with them normally. They're still hard to deal with, but uh, you can do whatever you <laughs> are normally planning to do to deal with them, to do a lot of damage in one turn. Um, you can use drip falls uh, to keep them down. Uh, the days, probably not enough, but you can, you'll can you have to keep drip falling in them until you kill last divinity. Or you could use what I got in this run. Um, I mean, I... I this is the one I got, uh, which is Crushing Demise, which, unlike uh, Ninja Training, it does not treat them as bosses in Last Divinity, so it's a little inconsistent. Um, I also uh, wanted to try out, if I could, um, the Crushing Demise reform kind of, I guess you could call it a build. Uh, I had it as part of my Five Ways to Win in Limbo series. Um, I didn't start off with any reforms, though, <laughs> so... Uh, that's not going to necessarily work. There are, uh, uh, there's an uncommon card, and uh, a common card, and a rare card that can all give me reform. Um, there's also several cards that can give you burnout extension. So I'm confident that if I go the burnout path, which I will take if it's offered, that I will be able to use that champion uh, with something in the first couple of rings. I'm hoping for molded personally, but we'll see if it comes up. Uh, hmm. I'll, I'll take jack strips, and I do have a tomb, a couple tombs. Let's go with that. Um, and this first ring will be, of course, the most rough if I go burn bright, which I am, because uh, because of all of those dead weights, I am unlikely to draw into my champion again so i'm actually even considering playing it because of that unlikeliness to mean i don't have to deal with no i'm not going to play it because 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 of all the wonderful things you know. um i do have two tombs that can do a lot of the damage um, I'm going to also play out everything that I can so that it's more likely I draw my champ. So, I'm going to play this and this. Ice Tornado will do a lot of damage as well. And we're, we're killing it, nice. Um... 
I mean, it's something. That's a reform. I'm gonna skip. I'm gonna go for spell upgrades here. We're looking for holdovers. It's gotta be crushing demise, I think. I wanna do holdover hollowed halls, but I think I'm gonna have more crushing demises. Um, and so that's my thought, at least. Spell chain. I should have spell chained it. Um, this is nuts. One in, but one and then two cost. Eventually is what's gonna happen. And let's. Uh, we need to remove so many cards. This means I'm more likely to draw in my second cycle, basically. Okay, we get this going. Not bad. Not bad at all. And we're doing it. These tombs are MVP. That's not going to hold up. But now I have a vaulted, so it's all good. So we're going to... I don't know. Um, we're going to dupe this. Minus two cost on this. Purge this. Uh, we're just needing to remove as many cards as we can, and we don't have the money to do much. Build a card. Um, I mean, I'm probably going to just not do this. Leave it be. Do nothing. Um, yeah. Let's get you down here. Then we'll get you down here. I'm not going to play this. Okay. Regret everything. Get you in here. Okay, we want to reform you as much as possible. you at least. I'm hoping it's enough. Yeah, it's enough but barely. We need more reforms. Uh, no. Maybe I should have done Endless on the uh, the tomb. I don't know. But we're taking draw. And probably removals. Yeah, removals. Get rid of the train stewards. Of hollowed halls mainly. Reduce the cost of this. No, let's look for a holdover. Nope. Okay, reduce the cost. And remove. 
Oops. Okay. Hopefully that's enough. Can we remove another one? We can. We can remove the last train steward. Until I have a holdover reform, I can't realistically uh, get away with what I was hoping to do with two crushing demises. I guess I'll play one now. Not good. Okay. I think I get you in here. That's enough. No, oh, thank you. No, oh, thank you. More removals. I'll take it. We'll remove four gun power, four gun power. Um, eh. I guess I'll take Cheater's hand. Um, nope. We remove a drag. Cheater's hand is going to be annoying. Starting to get enough scaling here. The resin removal is another answer, but I'm going, kind of going all in on this strategy here. Um, I think going for holdover over removals, maybe 
Something I shouldn't be doing. I don't know. Let's remove another foregone power. Yeah, I could have just removed two cards there. We will infuse. Spell chain. Um, don't need spell chain unmolded. Actually, that's pretty strong. Uh, now that I think about it. Alright, here we go. We will do... You know what? Let's, uh... That's fine. Uh, we will get both of you and we'll do this. Not bad. I don't care. I'm annoyed by <laughs> Cheater's Hand already. Just gonna keep that molded in the deck. Keep you around. Um, yeah, let's return that. Uh, we will do this. I don't know about Holotals is kind of weird. Um, we'll return. I don't know. We'll just return this. It's fine. Definitely not molded. Alright, Holotals is good. We'll return this. Nice. I don't want to risk it. <laughs> Another all in all. You know what? Sure. And we're gonna take draw. And removals. Let's remove. Uh, foregone powers are useless. Let's remove a drag so I get the same units back. Reef molded. I don't know why it took that money randomly. Should be okay though. Okay. One crushing device. You know what? I'm gonna save this for next turn. We will put you down here, crushing demise, and hollow dolls. Okay. 
return this. Crush and demise. All the is here. We're a little behind. Get you guys in here. Get you back down here where you belong. You in here. Catching up. A little bit. Uh, we're keeping all of this stuff. Okay. Hollowed halls. So we kill you. Kill you. All dolls. Yeah, good enough. Kill you back. Good enough. All right, we will hollowed halls. And we're killing. Excellent. I'm good. And we're good. I just want removals and dupes, but which I can't have both. Um, I just want molded. I have two of them and they have spell chain. Okay, let's uh, do removals. So it's going to be removing foregone power and drag. Problem with Hollowed Halls right now is that of course it's slower. Um, I just want the tomb and my champion, I think. Could even do endless here, and then you don't get hollowed halls. Works for me. Okay, one reform, which means we'll kill the champ once. That's the idea. No, we have two reforms, but we only have one kill. Okay, so we get you in here. Kill. Reform. Get you in here. Do some damage. We have some stuff, so we will let you deal with those guys. Kill ya. Kill ya. Kill ya. Um, get this out of here, I guess. And do some damage. By damage, I mean get rid of your damage shield, I guess. Alright. Nope, not that. We will do this. And what the heck, we will hollow dolls up here. Alright, we will. Do some damage. A little behind, but that's okay. We have two reform, three reforms. Put you up here, and we reform. Get you down here, and we reform. Get 
We have two reforms, excellent. Reform. Reform, you know what, let's uh, just deal with these guys. Get that damage shield going. Man, how many damage shields you got? We will uh, deal with you. I don't wave. Okay, we have plenty of reforms. Um, you down here? Um, man, you have shard enhanced. Okay. Uh, well, I don't really want to play Crushing Demise. I might just let that guy get to the pyre. No, he'll die eventually. So, um,. I guess Crushing Demise is fine. We'll return this. Okay, yeah, we have plenty of reforms now. So, uh, we get you back. We'll kill you. Get you back. Hollowed halls. Hollowed halls. And boom, you're dead. Nice. I'm worried about my lack of crushing demises, though, for the final area. Okay, I have plenty of reforms this turn, so let's kill ya, reform, kill ya, reform. Alright, um, I could hollowed halls, it's fine, we'll do this next turn. save this for next turn. Alright, so we're going to kill ya. Does this kill you? It does. And you're going to die from jack strips. We'll reform. Kill ya. Reform. Good enough. Of hollow halls, I'll do this next turn. Kill ya. Kill you. Kill ya. Yeah, I mean, kind of wasting my damage right now, but it's going on the boss at least. Um. Okay. I want all of these. So we kill you. Kill you. Reform. Kill you. You in here. Save that. A little behind. Okay. Three waves remain. I think let's save that for next turn just in case. Kill you? No, of course not. 
Get you in here. Kill you. Actually, just get that one going. Okay. Uh, card to return, this one, just in case. Kill you. Um, kill you, get you back. Good enough. Alright, next turn we have... Uh, I want to make sure I have a reform next turn. So we will... Kill you. Kill ya. Get you in here. Okay. Get rid of this. This is relentless. Uh, we uh, kill ya. Get you back. Kill ya. Get back. 3,600. And we're doing it. Man, that was that was kind of close. Um, I would have preferred more uh, molded um, in crushing devices. But uh, since I didn't start with the molded, I kind of was playing from behind for this specific strategy from the start. Cool. We did it. That one was a little challenging. Um, spell chain certainly MVP there, I think. Maybe I should have spell chained that crushing demise instead. Cool. I'm um, just looking. Hollowed Halls. That's surprising. That's a good card. I'm just, I guess I haven't done any Last Affinity runs with it. Cool. And um, there we go. We got uh, four left. Uh, I think there's actually 30. Let me look at that, though. So there's four left. Nope. There's actually only 25. So, homework, which is just a normal run. Uh, steward's Knack, kind of a pain in the butt. Largest Lads, pain in the butt. And Stealthy boss, Bosses, kind of the same issue here. Um, even worse, though. So, I'm uh, going to need to do... Uh, no, I'm not going to do this strategy, because I already did it. Um, but we're going to need something, th maybe to deal with those mini-bosses, and perhaps it's one of the other things I talked about. Resin removal, uh, trip fall, uh, cave in, uh, just killing them with spells, which is kind of what I did here. I had crushing device, but I mean spell damage is what I mean. Um, or uh, an infinite. Maybe I'll go for an infinite here. I don't know that duality really makes sense, but uh, that's for another run. Thank you for watching. We'll see you next time.